Are you having trouble finding a puppy on online classifieds? I sure as heck did when I was looking. So in 2020, a lot of puppies were sold during COVID. And a lot of people were searching for this. So I'm a little late on this. I wasn't searching for a dog till near the end of COVID. That's when we were ready to buy a puppy. Didn't have anything to do with staying home during COVID. <clears throat> Excuse me. Craigslist technically doesn't allow the sale of dogs on uh, their classifieds. People still post, but they get flagged and taken down. And so most of the reputable breeders, they don't want to post on there because I keep having to repost their ads because uh, animal rights Nazis are always flagging them and getting them pulled off of their Facebook marketplace. They've got better ways of controlling this uh, through uh, programming so people can't uh, get those things posted or they get their uh, Facebook account banned because they're uh, selling dogs online. You'll find pages on Facebook, of course, where uh, a breeder posts that they've had puppies, but you'll never see them post a price. You'll never, you rarely get them to say how many puppies are already spoken for, all that kind of stuff. Sometimes you can direct message them and get a response and buy a dog that way. But the search function on Marketplace is what a person really needs to be able to use to buy a dog because uh, it's not easy to search and find puppies for sale just by searching uh, Facebook pages. So anyway, the source that I found that was useful is Hoobly. It's free online classified for both buyers and sellers. I believe it's free. It's free for me as a buyer, that was for sure. And there's a lot of dogs on here, but uh, it's free to use. And there's reputable breeders in here, as well as some of the puppy mills, which you'll have to watch for. Uh, but if you don't, if you don't use this, a lot of people will get so frustrated that they end up having to buy from a puppy mill because they can't go through normal online classifieds, and they search and search and search for for days and weeks and months, and they say, "Heck with it! I'm just going to buy from one of those places in Pennsylvania that will ship one to me." And you're buying from most likely a puppy mill. Some places, uh, some reputable breeders will breed, uh, will ship a dog to you, but that's a lot less likely uh, to be a reputable breeder, certainly as possible. Don't be offended if you're a breeder. So to use Hubley, it's not uh, it's not the most intuitive website, but you can refine things the way a nor you normally would, and it will not take very long to get used to. This is the opening page here. You need to narrow down your search area by clicking this and we'll only be able to select United States, but you come back up here again and you can select your state. And when you go up to Indiana, you can then select a city. I don't suggest you narrow it down further than state. I, unless you're in a huge state, I guess, then the search will be harder. But odds are, if you're looking for a specific dog, you're going to have to drive four, five, six, seven, eight hours to buy this dog. So just leave this state and then go here. We need to narrow down our categories. This isn't just dogs on this website, but this has become the go-to place for dogs you you can see all these other listings there's only seven here for clothing collect but look 1400 for pets and animals and we do need to narrow it down to dogs because they sell other stuff on here and we can even narrow it down to breed now just because your breed isn't listed here doesn't mean it's not for sale in another area this only lists the ones that have a listing in the in our selected search area which is the state of indiana and it fortunately it does tell you how many of these are on here a lot of german shepherds a lot of golden doodles looking for one of those <clears throat> now prices during covid some of these things were going like 2500 cheapest you could find was uh you know maybe 2000 in the heart of covid but Every breeder who could possibly breed a dog was trying to get puppies 
last year because the prices were so high and there was so much demand for dogs. I'm sure they've overcompensated and I would guess now you can expect to get a really sweet deal on a dog if that's what you're looking for. I would tend to find exactly the dog you want and try and pay up for it without paying an uh, exorbitant fee just to get the dog that you like and the dog that you want. Now, you will still find puppy mills on here. It is a little easier to say, uh, they might be a little easier to find on this because uh, you can find out the area they're from. Unfortunately, areas where there's a really high Amish population, there, there's a lot more likely to be a puppy mill type setting. They're breeding dogs more like livestock. They're doing it to make money because people are buying the darn things. Uh, probably because they can't find them on Facebook and Craigslist. They're just paying up and getting them shipped. Whatever. Could be perfectly good dogs there. You might get a good dog from uh, one of those places. Uh, but you're more likely to get a, get a bad dog because they're just finding the breed getting the puppies pushed out they're not always trying to be selective in the in the parents that they use and so forth and so on anyway but what is nice about those areas where there's a large percentage of puppy mills it drives the price down on reputable breeders too and so you'll hear a lot of people say well don't don't buy a puppy in pennsylvania and they're all are all Amish puppy mills out there. It's like, well, no, if you do your, your searching, you'll find some reputable breeders and you'll actually get a pretty sweet deal because the mills will drive the price down. Anyway, I've talked long enough. Please subscribe if you got anything out of this video. I, uh, I need subscriptions. I don't particularly need the hours. I'll be monetized anytime if I get subscriptions. So throw me a pity subscription if you're willing to do that. I would appreciate it. Thank you very much.